so uh, I was sad by the death of her uh, friend, June Dilworth Brown, who taught at Seattle Pacific, but I knew her as a Sunday school teacher in college. And um, she, at one point, told this group of young adults, uh, we've had enough Sunday school, we need to put faith into action. And she got us uh, going to Branchville, a nursing home, uh, to put on church service instead of having Sunday school together. So uh, I remember, uh, this would be in the mid-70s, going with this group of young people to Branchville, which has got people that are coming off the street into retirement, into the nursing care. Uh, so it's got this weird... Uh, connection with my future life as the director of Operation Night Watch, and uh, my experience of singing uh, old-time gospel songs with the uh, uh, people in the nursing home and being pressed upon by June to provide the five-minute devotional once in a while was my first real taste of uh, ministry in that kind of a setting, and I think how her life impacted mine. I, I, I know... I wouldn't be at Operation Night Watch today, I'm pretty certain, without having had that inner city experience with her uh, in, in an inner city nursing home. There were people in that nursing home who appear in the 1970 uh, Night Watch training film as Night Watch uh, uh, friends at Operation Night Watch in the 1970s. I, I think it's incredible connection 